Watch out, Commissioner Gordon. Are you hurt? I'm all right, Inspector Mulligan. Someone just threw a rock through the window. Sorry about that, Commissioner. You know how it is with these vandals today. Well, that Mulligan was no ordinary vandal. Will you please hand me the note that was tied to the rock? Oh, here you are, Commissioner. Hmm. Listen to this, Mulligan. I'll read it to you. It says, Batman and Robin, I have escaped from Arkham Asylum, and revenge will be sweet. Free once again to pursue my dishonorable profession. If you try to play your hand against mine, you will find the Joker is wild. Signed, the Joker. Oh, that is bad news, oh. Commissioner. I'll put out a 306 and alert the entire Gotham City Police Force. The Joker must be apprehended and incarcerated. Who knows what dastardly crime he might perpetrate next? Very good, Mulligan. A 306 will be your first move. Now... Hand me the hotline phone. Batman and Robin must be informed of this dire emergency that threatens Gotham City. Hello, Commissioner Gordon. Batman here. Yes? The Joker escaped. Huh. Nothing we can do right now, Commissioner. But knowing how the Joker operates, he'll be contacting you very shortly. I'll be waiting near the hotline to hear from you as to further developments. Goodbye, sir. Here we go again, Batman. Things were too quiet for a while. When your hotline rang, I knew it spelled trouble. Well, I think we'll get a little action now. Right you are, Robin. The Joker has always been a real challenge. We'll get plenty of action if my memory serves me right. He's a very clever arch criminal who must be put away. Like I said, Commissioner, the Joker doesn't waste any time. The Gotham City Museum of Fine Arts... We're on our way. What's the pitch, Batman? No time for talking now, Robin. Into the Batmobile. I'll tell you on the way. Please, Batman, clue me in. What's happening? Well, Robin, we're on our way to the Gotham Museum of Fine Arts. The Joker showed his hand. He promises to steal the famous Picasso painting of the clowns. The museum's most valuable possession. Exactly. It seems the clowns in the painting have a special fascination for the Joker. He wants to rescue them from the eyes of the curious who come to laugh at their image. You know, Batman, the Joker really belongs in Arkham Asylum. He's a paranoiac who's a menace to our society. Maybe a frontal lobotomy might help in his case. With Robin, up the steps. Right behind you, Batman. Can I help you, gentlemen? Oh, my word. It's you, Batman and Robin. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Huntington Waterbury, curator of Gotham City Museum of Fine Arts. Is there something wrong, gentlemen? We don't know yet, sir. Can you lead us to the Picasso exhibit? Well, I don't understand. Well... Please, follow me. Mr. Waterbury, Gotham City's police department received a warning that the Joker has escaped from Arkham Asylum. He intends to steal Picasso's painting of the clowns. You see for yourself, Batman. It's there on the wall. Everything seems to be in order. I'll double the security guard now that I know of the threat. Oh, my goodness. Look over there in the corner, Batman. One of my guards is lying there with a ghoulish grin on his face. I'm afraid the poor devil is done for, Mr. Waterbury. Another innocent victim of this homicidal maniac. The insidious Joker has been here already. He always leaves his victims laughing. Oh, poor Mr. Wilson. He was one of my best security men. And not too many years from his retirement pension. What now, Batman? Examine the painting again, Mr. Waterbury. What do you see? Why, why, it's not the real Picasso. This is a poor copy. The real Picasso must be found. Please, Batman, it must not fall into the wrong hands. This is a very clever delaying tactic of the Joker, trying to fool us while he gets away with the original. Batman, is everything all right? 
Glad to see you, Inspector Mulligan. You're just a little late. A guard has been killed, and the Picasso is missing. The alleged perpetrator has to be the Joker. Good thinking, Mulligan. Now, if you will excuse me, Robin and I are off to Pier 47. There's an old abandoned warehouse there that the Joker used as a hideout. Come, Robin. We'll try to head him off. You can follow us, Mulligan. Hey, Batman, things are really cooking. I wanted action, and the Joker is giving it to us in spades. Well, you ask for it, Robin. Oh, wow, Batman. This place gives me the creeps. Only a weirdo like the Joker would use this dump for a hideout. We've got to move very quietly, Robin. The Joker is in here for sure. Now watch your step, Robin. Don't trip on anything. Oops! I tripped, Batman. Look! It's a body. Yeah, it's a dead one. Look at his face, Robin. A ghoulish grin. Must be the night watchman. The Joker left another one of his calling cards. <laughs> Batman and Robin! You remembered my hideout, curse you! You'll never catch me this time! Here! <laughs> Have a blast! Quick, Robin, get behind those cases. I'm going after the Joker. I'm going to give you a lesson in art, Joker. You're such an art lover. I'll show you the art of trumping a Joker with a handful of clubs. Ha <laughs> ha! You missed me, Joker. Now your gun is empty. Looks like you'll have to fight me on even ground, you fiend. <laughs> Come and get me, Batman. I can still use my fists. <laughs> Take that, Batman. Here's one for you, Joker. Many happy returns. He's getting away, Batman. He's running toward the end of the pier. Holy cow, Batman. I smell smoke. Quick, Robin. Turn in the fire alarm. This maniac has set fire to the warehouse. I'll take care of him. All right, Joker. I got you now. Where's the Picasso? <laughs> Not so fast, Batman. I'm diving off this pier, and when I do, you'll never catch me. I was captain of the swimming team at Arkham. <laughs> what a race! Here it goes! I forgot to mention a Joker. It happens to be low tide. For a slimy character like you, you should feel right at home. Where is he, Batman? Where is this monster? Take a look over the edge of the pier, Mulligan, and see the stew our friend the Joker has got himself into this time. He should be easy pickings for you. All right, boys. Bring a ladder. Go down and get him. Here comes Chief McDowley and the Gotham City Fire Department. I'm going into the warehouse to get the Picasso. Come back, Batman. Batman, you can't go into that blazing inferno. What are you doing here? Did I hear a Batman just went into that building to save the Picasso? Oh, my, Inspector Mulligan. Do you think you'll make it? He's an amazing individual, Mr. Walkerbrick. If Batman sets out to do something, rest assured it will be done. Here he comes. Hooray, Batman, you made it. You saved the picture. Here you are, Mr. Waterbury, the real Picasso. Careful, it's a bit warm. Thank heavens you're safe, Batman. Oh, this picture is hot. Well, who cares it's safe? Let me inspect it more carefully. Ah, yeah. 
It's perfect, perfect. How can I thank you enough, Batman? The look on your face when Batman handed you the Picasso, Mr. Waterbury, says more than a thousand words. Speaking for myself and Robin, I should like to say it was done for the true lovers of art who appreciate the work of a genius. If this arch criminal had gotten away with the painting, its loss would have been felt by posterity. All right, boys, put the cuffs on the Joker. Bring him down to the station house. <laughs> You may have me under lock and key for now, Mulligan. I promise you someday I'll escape again. They call me the Joker, but remember in the game of life, the Joker is wild. Goodbye for now, Batman and Robin. We shall meet again. <laughs> Looks like the fire's under control. All's well that ends well. What do you think, Robin? Did you have enough excitement for one day? Oh, wow, Batman. You're too much. I'm afraid all this excitement has worn me out completely. I sure hope they put the Joker away a good long while this time. Robin, knowing the cleverness of this artful dodger, who can say for sure? Perhaps a frontal lobotomy would be the answer. If science could operate on this distorted brain and put it to good use, society would reap a great benefit. Come, Robin, into the Batmobile and home. Alert the entire Gotham City police force. The Joker must be apprehended and incarcerated. Who knows what dastardly crime he might perpetrate next? Very good, Mulligan. A 306 will be your first move. Now, hand me the hotline phone. Batman and Robin must be informed of this dire emergency that threatens Gotham City. Hello, Commissioner Gorman. Rang, I knew it spelled trouble. Well, I think we'll get a little action now. Right you are, Robin. The Joker has always been a real challenge. We'll get plenty of action if my memory serves me right. He's a very clever arch-criminal who must be put away. Like I said, Commissioner, the Joker doesn't waste any time. The Gotham City Museum of Fine Gordon. Batman here. Yes? The Joker escaped... Huh. Nothing we can do right now, Commissioner. But knowing how the Joker operates, he'll be contacting you very shortly. I'll be waiting near the hotline to hear from you as to further developments. Goodbye, sir. Here we go again, Batman. Things were too quiet for a while. When your hotline... It says, Batman and Robin, I have escaped from Arkham Asylum, and revenge will be sweet. Free once again to pursue my dishonorable profession. If you try to play your hand against mine, you will find the Joker is wild. Signed, the Joker. Oh, that is bad news, oh. Commissioner. I'll put out a 306 and a... Watch out, Commissioner Gordon. Are you hurt? I'm all right, Inspector Mulligan. Someone just threw a rock through the window. Sorry about that, Commissioner. You know how it is with these vandals today. Well, that Mulligan was no ordinary vandal. Will you please hand me the note that was tied to the rock? Oh. Here you are, Commissioner. Hmm. Listen to this, Mulligan. I'll read it to you. 